Breakout.edu is an engaging way for students to learn any content by collaboratively solving problems, uh, completing challenges in, in an effort to uh, unlock either physical boxes or uh, digital levels uh, and to complete levels of challenge and go through until they finally break out uh, and uh, accomplish the challenge. Since 2016, um, Breakout has been offered in Tech Academy. Lisa Toman has offered how to make a digital breakout and how to do a physical breakout. So it has been offered in Tech Academy. Um, and word of mouth, people have learned about it and then they help each other learn how to do a breakout. A digital breakout would be on your computer on the Breakout EDU website. And a physical one would be something a teacher or other teachers would set up for you and you also do the same thing but just walk around and figure out the clues and maybe write them down. Basically during a breakout I am walking around watching the kids encouraging them occasionally I have to give them a hint so that they don't give up but I'm basically a cheerleader and celebrating with them and helping with technical support if needed. I like breakout EDUs because I get to work on the puzzles and the clues and it's really fun to just work with someone else and get them done. I really like breakout EDUs because you get the opportunity to do it with a friend and you can help each other out. I like doing the breakouts than a normal lesson because in a normal lesson you don't really get to like work with a group or something and figure out stuff. It's pretty fun because you just get to like free your mind. It's kind of like a little recess. It's really fun. The really neat thing about a breakout is the children who are really good at academics can shine with some of the clues and kids who are creative thinkers can shine with other clues. You start to see different strengths from kids so you might think oh this child is really going to be good at the breakout and their strength is in a different area so it allows children to shine in different ways. Today during the breakout I was asked to look at the clues and then look at the picture so then I had to figure out, so it feels like color, I maybe had to figure out like what colors and what color would go in order. So then once I finish that, if you get it done, you can press submit or you can go back to try working on another one if you're puzzled on that one. We talk a lot about persevering. We talk a lot about problem solving and working together as a team. And those are skills that we're working on throughout the whole year. And each time we do a breakout, the children are getting better at that. And so they're understanding better how to be a team player, how to work together, how to problem solve, how to look at things critically and analytically. So my measure of success for this is their ability to sustain their attention and stick with a problem even when it's difficult. And I see that translate into other subject matters and we can tie it back in and say, even though we don't necessarily solve the problem right away, with a lot of hard work and with teamwork, we can accomplish anything.